Now to an interesting apartment sale in New Jersey. John Corzine's Hoboken, New Jersey apartment is on the market for nearly $3 million. Kayla Tausche has a look inside. Kayla, good morning. Good morning, Carl. Well, if you head on over to the website for realtor Halliburton Homes, if you've got $2.9 million that are burning in a hole, a hole in your pocket, this is what you'll find. You'll find former MF Global CEO John Corzine's Hudson River penthouse, 2,400 square feet, two bedrooms, four bathrooms, and floor-to-ceiling views of the Hudson River and Manhattan skyline. Corzine bought the condo in Hoboken's Maxwell Place Towers while serving as the Garden State's governor in 2008. He paid $3.26 million, not 3.6 as I misread on air yesterday, but that's still 11% more than it's going for right now. The property does require $38,000 in taxes on real estate. The Hudson County tax assessors most recently quoted at just over $822,000. Of course, the bankruptcy of the futures brokerage in October 2011 for Corzine out as chief and into the hot seat as some $1.2 billion of customer money went unaccounted for. Carl, that's money customers themselves have tried to put Corzine on the hook for as they tried to get it back. It's unclear whether this is a so-called capital raise for Corzine. Yeah, I mean, it's hard to find people who predict he's going to have an active political life going forward, but if he did, this would have ramifications on his political life, yes? Yeah, it would because, of course, you need residency and wherever you're planning to run for an elected office, Corzine served as as a U.S. Senator representing New Jersey from 2001 to 2006, at, at which time he was elected governor of New Jersey. He said in an interview with the Jersey Journal in 2010, right after he was defeated by Chris Christie, I doubt very seriously that I'll ever be on the elected side of things again, but never say never. Of course, in August 2011, they did issue bonds that stepped up in the case that Corzine got a federal appointment, but it looks like that could be off the table too, Carl. All right, Kayla Tausche, thank you for that. Uh, Kayla, back at headquarters. Today.